Right, okay, question number 17. So we've got uh, a fish tank and we've got these dimensions measured to this in centimetres. So this looks already looks like a bound question to me. She's going to f use a bucket to fill up the tank uh, and this is measured with a degree of accuracy and she want, we want to know with the 25 full buckets. Okay, well, first of all, let's think about if this is measured to the nearest centimetre, then this has got an error bound ranging from 69.5 to 70.5. That's the upper bound and the lower bound. Same thing for the 40 centimetres. Got an upper bound of 40.5 centimetres and a lower bound of 39.5. An upper bound of 120.5 and a lower bound of 119.5. Okay. For a bucket of 14 litres, in our bucket, is measured to the nearest litre, so it's got an upper bound of 14.5 and a lower bound of 13.5. So we want to know whether 25 full buckets of water would definitely fill the fish tank. So we want to think in the worst case scenario. So we want to consider the worst case of where the tank is the biggest possible tank with the smallest possible bucket. Okay? Uh, so the biggest possible tank. It would take, if we did it the other way around, the smallest possible tank with the biggest possible bucket, then, then that will be the other way. That will be the least number of buckets of water. But we want to see whether these 25 will fill it up. So let's consider the worst case. So let's find the volume of the tank. But let's find the upper bound for the volume of the tank. So the upper bound is going to be, if I take the volume 20.5 to multiply by the 40.5 multiplied by the uh, 70.5. In that case, the maximum volume comes out as 344,057.625 centimetres cubed, which I convert into litres, so it's the same as the buckets. I suppose I could convert the bucket to centimetres cubed, but let's, let's convert this to litres, so divide it by 1,000. So 344, just over 344 litres is the maximum possible volume. So if we consider the capacity of the bucket, so let's take the lower bound, we're going to take 13.5 litres. If we do 25 times this, 25 buckets. We come out with 337.5 litres. So you should be able to see that if we compare this to this, we actually potentially, if the bucket has been uh, over measured, it's actually smaller. So we're taking the lower bound and we take 25, so the smallest possible bucket size, it's actually not going to be enough to fill the worst case, which is the biggest possible tank. So uh, we need to just write a sentence, this is not enough to fill the tank. Okay, and then we're done.